the indexed stack widget. If I click on different button, this will change the image on the screen. This is because we use the index stack widget. To create something like this, we will start with the int index equals zero. Inside the padding, we will create a column widget. And in the children, we will start with a row. The children inside the row will be first an elevated button with the text zero. It's the first button you can see on the screen. The onPress will set state and set the index to zero. This is the variable we created at the start. We will create two other elevated button, one that will set the index to one and one that will set the index to two. In this way, we can change the value of the index variable. It's now time to create the indexed stack widget. The index argument will be the index variable we created. The children will be three different image. And now when we click the buttons to change the index, this will automatically switch between these three widget. This was how to use the index stack widget with your Flutter app.